after their covert relationship ended, TJ, Holmes and Amy Robach talked about their drinking habits and how they spent $2,869 on alcohol in December alone. Every year in January, a lot of individuals participate in Dry January, a period of abstinence from alcohol, frequently as a means of resetting their bodies and minds after overindulging during the holidays. In their podcast, Amy Robach and TJ, Holmes disclosed their decision to abstain from alcohol this month as well as their overall alcohol consumption, especially in the past year following the revelation of their covert relationship and their termination as co-anchors of GMA3, what you need to know. Actually, after totaling their receipts, they discovered that they had spent $2,869 on alcohol in just in December. The former ABC News workers gave a candid and grim assessment of their alcohol usage in the Amy and TJ episode A Year on the Rocks. They acknowledged that their drinking had risen following their split from GMA3, and in the wake of the affair allegations, the holidays brought in a lot of relatives and friends, and while Amy Robach winced at the absurd monetary value of their purchases, TJ, Holmes said that the most recent month was also a large one. We spent a total of $2,869 on alcohol in December. Clearly, after tallying up their drizzly orders and receipts from their outings, the pair arrived at that number, and TJ, Holmes said he was glad not to spend a significant portion of that money this January. Furthermore, they were honest about how much they drank in addition to examining how their alcohol purchases affected their bank account. Amy Robach had to revise her estimate after realizing that one drink is equivalent to just five ounces of wine or one shot of spirits. Originally, she had anticipated that she would have 15 to 20 drinks each week. Now, she says she has more than 30 drinks. She acknowledged that the fervor in the media surrounding her and TJ, Holmes contributed to that, stating,